Hey everyone, we're back. Um, I don't know how I'm sounding here. I'm not 100% here today. We're gonna make this work. Um, I wanna finish XCOM so badly I can taste it. June. Eh, not a record, but that's okay. I really should have. I really, I, I really was hoping I could grab the, uh, the psionics thing. That really slowed me down. I know it did. Oh well. Do do do. Bring him down, baby. Eleven. Whoop. All right. Quick craft. Go. Armor, personal, power suit. Oh, we have a bunch of newbies there. How many did I pack? Three newbies? Alright, let's check them out real quick. Wait, can I look at them from here? No. Oh, cool. Look at that. Wow. Okay, she's brave at least. Won't panic. That's something. Won't panic easily. Wow, no. Now let's get rid of these two. I really, really would have liked to be able to have a uh, psionic for this final assault. <sighs> well, we all make do with what we got. That's life, right? Um. Yeah, it's life. It stinks. Alright, let's bring you up. So you're a squatty, you're a squatty. Four rookie valueless ones. Um, three of those. Let's get rid of uh, you and bring another rookie. Let's bring a lot of rookies on this mission. Let's 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 do some blooding here. No. I don't want to begin the mission. This thing has insane fuel. I don't know what that thing would be in the real world. I'm just gonna say that right now. Like, what the heck kind of aircraft would have that kind of range? Um, just gonna say it one time, uh, out loud. Melissa. Huh? Huh? Okay, what do we got? Um, can't tell. So let's pull out the brain ball. Melissa, where are you? Alright, let's brain ball that bad boy. Mm -hmm. We have sectoids. Alright, so if I'm lucky... Alright, you know what? I'm sorry. I really do want to capture a sectoid commander. Alright, so we have a sectoid down there. Hold on. I'm trying to get eyes on that second one, by the way, just in case people are like, what the heck are you doing? Why are you trying to get these people killed? Um, I saved for a reason. Alright, what do we got? Well, it's banged up, whatever it is. Um... Where is he? Hello? Where are you? There they are. Okay.
maybe we're gonna get lucky. I really want a commander. I, I don't care how much cheese I need for it. Um, it is a lot, a lot better. Soldier, okay. It is a lot, lot better if you have a commander for the final assault than if you don't. Um, because psionics makes this so much easier fighting materials. Okay. Well, you suck. Alright, let's bring you forward. This is what happens when you bring newbies on these missions. Seriously. Uh... actually burned through a bunch of their fire, so it was worth it in my book. Got him. Awesome. Um, did anyone get hit there? I'm surprised no one got hit. Hmm. Um, now we're just going to save. I am totally scumming this because I really, really hope there's a commander in that thing. I don't know if there will be. I know there probably isn't. Um, but, but man, if I can get a commander... Alive. Alive, Commander. Alright. Um, it would be worth it. Like, really worth it. Alright, do the one on the right. No. Throw the ball to the next person. Use the ball on the other one. Both are soldiers. Okay. Now is a time where we would use a grenade. Wow. Isn't that weird? Well, that's the thing. Hmm. That's a real thing right there. Let's see if we can't hit it again. Okay. Um. Yeah. Let's see what we can't do here. Boom. Last one down. Um, the turn was really short, so I would not be surprised if that was all they had. Yep, that's all they have. And boom. No alien commander. Um, potentially just dead dead on a crash. And we have the plasma rifle before we have... Uh, before we have... Uh, psionics. Can't say I'm surprised. Hyperwave decoder is complete. Dismantle you. And that is a really awful layout, but it works. I'll be honest. It works. Okay, so now there is a huge exclusion zone there created by those two uh, hyperwave decoders. The aliens are basically, if they did have a base over here, I'd know about it at this point. Um, I think. Does it decode bases? I'm assuming it does. I don't remember. UFO construction, new gen fighter craft. Um, let's go ahead and put five into this. I have to admit, if I'm not going to have plasma, if I'm not going to have a psionics, I need plasma. <laughs> I'm just going to say it now. New generation fighter craft. Um, I really should have done extra research labs. Oh well. Um, huh. Muton harvester. Where are you? Where are you going? Europe. Okay, so let's send a little gift to you. And dude, if you count e Western, Eastern Russia as Europe, I'm going to question your definition. Bring him down. Off. <sighs> when 
One of the things I don't know yet is, will that damage translate to the ground battle? I, I don't honestly know. Um, because generally if I do that well, I finish him off with a second interceptor. Uh, because that's how you roll. And Mutons, I'd prefer them to have ended up in the drink, to be honest. Because they are just annoying. Um, maybe, maybe there's like an ethereal tucked under there somewhere, but I doubt it. And they are extremely resistant to, uh... Extremely resistant to, uh... Laser. Well, that one actually went down pretty fast. Um, but we get to do a harvester ship. Yay. I don't think I've done one of those yet. Isn't that exciting? Mm. Yeah, not really. Alright. My rookie, my cannon fodder is spreading out. I really wish I didn't have cannon fodder yet. Um, but that's all right. Uh, we'll make do. Man, psionics would make this so much easier. Um, I didn't turn on line at side or anything, did I? I don't think so. Oh! Well, that was unexpected. It's like a party! Um, I'm not, I'm not going for, I'm not going for anything here. Screw that. <laughs> I just realized I ain't trying to get some leader or nothing. I gotta get rid of the cannon fodder. Come on, rookie, show me what you got. goes really bad, I'll reload. Like, I don't know what's really bad. Just to be clear, if I had psionics, those people would have been fired. Like, not, not sent into dying. Um, just because I know for a certainty whether they're worth anything or not. Um, and they're not. So. Uh, did I forget to move? I did. Uh, crap. Um, you go back. Ah, crap. Okay, yeah. Nope, that one forces it right there. Hmm? Did I use aimed auto shot on this? Hmm. Well. Whatever I used the last time, I didn't use it this time. Yeah, you're gonna die. I wish I cared. I just, I just was like, you know, uh, what time does this start? Geoscape. No, I don't want to delete it. I want to go to it. Huh? Yeah, that's what I was afraid of. I'm well, going to try and shoot him down into the water. Because, honestly, it's better than actually dealing with him in person. Um... I know. I'm being a good person. Um, I just don't want to deal with muttons. If I, I need either, I need either the, I need either the. Uh, oops. See, this is what you get when you're talking. 
This is annoying. Sheesh, you're not supposed to talk and play. I need the uh, thing that comes, the plasmic rifle, at least. Um, the best way to deal with muttons is psionics, though. They are physically tough. That's it. They're like meat shields. And trying to fight them with the wrong weapon is really irritating. Like, really irritating. Alright, let's buy a bunch of missiles. There we go. Uh, a harvester, and it is a mutton one, and it is heading to Europe. Oh my goodness, I am shocked. Shocked, I say. Alright. Over the water, best place to fight it. I love it, man. Too standard. Focus on actually hitting this thing. Boom. Love it. It's in the water. Perfect. Best way to deal with muttons. And yes, I know that's kind of fudging the whole rule about how I don't fight, or I fight every crash landing. <laughs> yeah. Brrr. Burr is my Antarctic. Okay. Stormy Burr. Oh my goodness. Okay, we have got Southern Africa. Okay. So we basically got all of Europe now 100% covered. Um, there ain't nothing alien in that part of the world now. We have two more. Three more. And we still have poor little Hawaii. <laughs> I don't think Hawaii will have a base. Mm. Mm -hmm. Pew! Down he goes. Oh no! You know what? I just realized I'm going to have a an aircraft built soon. I should actually make sure that the expensive workshop space that I have been pouring tons of resources into actually can build me a new craft. There we go. That might be useful later on. I don't know why. Oh, is he going to make it? Uh, no. Flying right back. Oh, yeah. That's, that's beautiful. Um, sectoid alien abduction. That is my ticket right there. Um, intercept Panama. Wait, 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 where were they? Oh, I really hope that was over water or land. <laughs> well. Uh, okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold your horses there. It's not going to make it. Floater, alien abduction, Europe. Yeah. Bring him down. What is with them? Where are they coming from? Uh, he's he's never going to make it. That crash height's going to disappear. <laughs> Pretty sure. That's okay. We'll have a new one. Down he goes. Um, well, maybe he'll make it. Let me rephrase this. He'll never make it to the next day. Mutton harvester. Europe. Cautious. Harvesters don't fight back. They also don't run. Boom. Down he goes. Alright, so now we have three. And I'd swear this one would have already disappeared by now. I'm a little surprised it hasn't. Um, but hey, I'm not complaining. That's actually sectoid, if I remember right. So, I'm happy. 
Come on, yield me some results, baby. Oh! Okay. Well, there's a bunch of sectoids at least. And dang, they are getting some good auto shot. All right, let's see what we got. One and two. Are either of you a commander? Let's find out. Yeah, I know, this is annoying. Um, if I have to do it without it, I will. Just to be clear here. Like, I will beat the game without without a, a uh, psionics. It's just going to be annoying. Like, really annoying. Soldier, soldier. Eh. Okay. Alright, well, we're going to go ahead and reload. Because, again, I'm actually trying to get something specific here. Not just... See how much they move? They don't. They don't. This is really important. Uh, they don't, like, understand the concept of your ship. Like, at all. <laughs> like, they did not go, Aha! There's your ship. We're going to gather around the entrance to that ship and wait for you, which is what intelligent enemies would do. They just meander around in circles, wandering around and around and around. And I'm really serious there. Um, soldier. Ah, you suck. But there's three soldiers alive. My odds of a dead commander aren't as bad. Um, there's the good news. All right. See another one? Where are you? Hello. Ooh. What do we have there? Someone who might be interesting. Are you a friend? Let's find out. No. Jerk. Alright, blow his head off. Color me not interested. <laughs> yeah, I know. Again, with high enough bravery, losing people isn't that big a deal. Uh, with high psionics, it's almost Im unimportant. You can pretty much forget about it. The problem is, is when you're fighting those ethereals and they start doing that stupid spam attack where they basically just sigh attack you over and over and over again and there's nothing you can do except stand there and take it. Um, aw, man. Live aliens recovered. One? Three aliens killed? Did I just get an alien, like, randomly? I only shot three, right? Honest question. Please come on, Lady Luck. It's a soldier. Ah, well... <sighs> Sigh. Alright, that was a floater abduction. That was a mutton abduction. So the floater one was first. Hyperwave transmissions decoded. I love it. A sectoid terror ship. <gasps> oh, no, 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 I did this all wrong. Whoa. Okay. Um, that, that was a misclick. Uh-huh. <laughs> promise. Okay. Let's not actually speed that up. Um, okay. Speed it up. I need to speed it up because it wasn't immediate. Do, 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 do. Okay. Center on. Intercept. Let's see. Panama. Intercept. Panama. Intercept. Fresh start. Alright. Oh, come on. I really don't want to do it over water. Cautious. Doing the wrong one. I don't care. Disengage. You hold off.
that is acceptable. Engage. That has a commander. It is not a maybe. There is a commander in there. Uh, right. These missions can just get dusted. For all I care. I think I don't think there's a penalty if you abandon them. And I am so saving before this, because seriously, there is a commander in there. Um, if he is alive, I have a chance at a commander. The only question is, is did he die in the crash? And I don't know if that's going to be randomly generated now or later. Honestly, I don't know. What I do know is, is I don't want to find out about it the moment I actually go to the mission. Um, we are dumping the newbies. Um, completely. No newbies allowed. I know that's I know that's harsh. Um, I really can't afford newbies on these mission on this mission. All right, so let's see what you got. Dump, dump, dump. Okay, and uh, dump. There we go. I got some cannon fodder. Armor. Everyone's armor. Okay. Plasma rifles. I can bling. Bling. Bring plasma rifles. I just need the stupid clip researched. Oh, 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 oh. Actually, I can't believe I forgot. Totally spaced. Nope. Uh, show me new. Oh, that's kind of cool. No. Alien weapons and equipment. There we go. Alright, eventually I find it. Eventually I have a brain. Um. Hmm? Plasma rifle. Okay, it's at 100%, 60%, 86, 30. Wow. Auto is 55 and 36. Um, wow. Uh, let's see, laser rifle. 100%, 50. 65%, 25%. Yeah. I think I'm going to like the laser plasma rifle. Can I just go over and see it? I can. Okay. Yeah, I think I'm going to like the plasma rifle. I get three aimed shots. I get three snap shots, and they're almost as good as aimed shots. Um, aimed shots are going to be really accurate. You know what? You know what? We're, we're, we're going to include that in my research here. Because you know what? Oh, I ain't doing plasma clips either. Oops. Yeah, let's fix that. That's a oops. I should be doing plasma at least. Or heavy, I mean. There we go. Let's fix that. Heavy plasma. Um, there we go. That way I know actually what damage I get from those numbers. Um, that is painful to wait. I don't want to see it disappear. I saved, right? Okay. <sighs> I don't care about those. Alright, that is day. Alright. Boom. Perfect. Alright. Yes, sir. Let us begin. Alright, what do we got? And I am so, so cheating. Sorry, I know, I know. I really don't want to save Scum, but I really want Psionics for the final assault. Um, I know it's cheap. I know it's lame. I know it's not cool and yada, yada, yada. But I'm doing it. Gosh dang it. Um, if I can, that is. You know, if I can't, well. We'll make do. Um. There we go. What is... Oh, it's the big dinosaur creature. Yeah, 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 those are easy. This is, yeah. This is about as juicy a target as I can get for a commander. Um, maybe I should have let him actually terrorize something. Maybe. Um, in my opinion, no. But I mean, you know, I, I can see why, like, you know, if we were looking at it from a textbook perspective, it's probably better to let him terrorize. I just don't see it as worth it. Um, the odds of the commander dying in the crash are just not good. I should have done this guy first. Is that the edge of the map? That is the edge of the map. Okay. Let's bring him further back then. 
Okay. Alright, we have an enemy. And another enemy. Boom. We have a leader. Mind control. Okay. Um, yep. That is what I came for. Um, it is what I came for. <sighs> See, the one outside shot at me, so he's not the commander. Let's bring a second one this direction. Um, and unfortunately, what we're basically going to look at is we're basically going to look at a lot of casualties with my cheap cannon fodder units. And then... And then we're just going to basically, uh, I mean, we're just going to look at a lot of casualties. I, I'll be honest. <laughs> if I have to lose everyone. Um, people who are susceptible to psionics are in my nice units. Theoretically, they are tougher because they have a high bravery. I say theoretically, but the honest truth is, is you don't know until you actually take them up against a psionic enemy. And um, I think this is the first psionic enemy I've really faced. Um, down he goes. Awesome. Um, berserk. Mm, could be worse. Bogdan. Gavrail. Um, and they're targeting, see, like, see, these are my weakest units from a bravery stat perspective. Yes. Um. So, I mean, it's not like I'm going, oh my goodness, what are they doing? I'm like, oh, I know what they're doing. Um, yeah, I, I already know. Um, where's that enemy? Huh? huh? Can I see him? I'm so confused. Okay, center screen. Oh, it's a re... Cyber disc! They float. Oh, I forgot. That's a floater. The dinosaur is a floater. Let's see if we can't take a shot. No. Okay. Well. Yeah, this is going to get ugly. All right. Aha! I see you! There we go. Guillermont. Louis Guillermont. Okay, I'm assuming, yep. Okay. Two good hits. Come on, one more. No! He's still taking it. Jerk face. Um, they're usually pretty weak to laser fire. Usually. I like laser fire for cyber discs, to be honest. I wouldn't say they are weak to it. I just, I like it as a choice. And the lack of psionic attacks against my people right now is part of what actually makes me think I have a decent crew when it comes to cyber resist psionic attacks. Okay, why are you carrying all the balls, man? Hmm? Okay. Let's get out there. Med kit. Heal, heal, heal. Not enough time. Oh, hello. Crap. Ah, you tried. Thank you. Oh, my. 
almost enough. Oh, that one went through his head. Come on, give him the head. I was hoping he'd be dead by now. Awesome. And I really shouldn't be taking shots at that alien out there with ver verifying. He is, in fact, just some rando. Pretty sure he is. Um, but let's go ahead and actually check. Where is Melissa? Alright. It's kind of weird having higher ranked people in this mission. I've gotten used to Melissa being kind of in charge. Uh, yeah, you're not the issue. Floating McFloat face. Soldier, nah, you're not the issue either. Let's see. Auto shoot. Yeah, because honestly, that's what I want to see. There's a chance I can hit this stupid cyber disc too. And I still get a second shot. Yeah, baby. Oh, no! <laughs> Why? I hate you. I really hate that click. I really hate that click. I really hate that click. I hate that click. Uh, seriously. I did not click that time. Like, seriously. Uh, anyway. It's a little glitchy there. I should have had a second aim shot. That's all I'm saying. Boom. No aliens died, from the sound of it anyway. That's a good sound. Nothing went... Arr! Which usually means we are safe. Ugh. There we go. Alright. Everyone's alive. Hold on to your buttons. Because it is going to get kind of bumpy. Okay. Alright. Mouse. Behave. Oh my goodness. I was like, man, you can't hit them at this point. See, look at their bravery. Morale, whatever you want to call it. They went, they just took a huge hit to morale. Um, we're going to keep them kind of surrounded in like hugsies, wugsies. In the vain hope that that helps. Um, but honestly, I don't think that's the commander. But let's double check. Yeah, that's a soldier. Alright, we're fine. I was say, typically the commander stays inside under my control. Yeah. Oh, not who I was expecting. Um. Well, that was unexpected. dying. Okay. They took damage. Let's check them out again. Not, oh, okay. Oh. You took damage. You took damage. Well, that was not helpful. Uh, let's see. Right, see, this is kind of a mission where it's like, I probably should have brought grenades. Like, honest statement there, you know. Um, just me being frank here. Because it's like, man, when it turns ugly like this, having brought grenades... Okay, he's under my control now. Hmm? 
Oh, it's floating. Ugh, I'm an idiot. you too. Honestly, you guys are pretty banged up. I'm going to try and keep you two alive. <laughs> I know he's a good soldier though. So we're going to try and keep him there. On the front, I mean. Uh, I think of him as a good soldier, although he did just shoot like someone. Berserk. That's not surprising. Color me shocked. Shocked, I say. Okay. Uh, again, I don't think the commander is outside. And based on what I just saw, that is probably one of the people I was fighting. But again, we just don't want to take chances here, guys. Um, we really don't. Oh my goodness. I hate these mouse, mouse clicks. I don't remember the game having that issue. Whatever. I I'd swear there's like a lag thing going on. That's all right. That's all right. It's it's annoying. I I'm sorry. I'm gonna complain about it. No, I'm not really sorry, but I mean you know. Well, maybe you don't. I'm gonna complain about it. Hmm. Is there a reload option? How do we got? Two more. So you can go here. You can join their squad. You can join their squad. And you can join the hunting squad. Having a plasma pistol or a laser pistol would be really nice. But that's okay. Again, not, not really important. Um, panicked. Yeah, Tommy, I know. You're just, you're just not cut out for this part of the mission. It's alright, kiddo. We're not upset. We like you. You've served us well. Stay calm. We remember your service. Thank you. Um, I find grouping tends to help with this. I don't know if it really does or not. Um, oh, I should. Who has the med kit? On this note, yeah. I should throw that to someone who can actually use it. <laughs> Just gonna say that now. Like, there's no point in carrying it, keeping the med kit on someone who's gonna stay behind the battle lines and potentially panic. Um, Zerk. Oh, you kill that dirt man. I love it. Panic. Was this the guy who got hit earlier? See, yeah. Um, I think it is. So we're just going to tell him to put his gun down. Nope, can't. Not surprising, to be honest. Okay. Um. There we are. Also not surprising. It's a soldier. Not surprising. Awesome. Good job. That was risky, but worth it. Bring him down. Uh, 
cut. We've got most of the, oh, oh. I was about to say, we got most of the outside it covered at this point. Um, it would appear, it would appear that we have a late mine probe soldier. All right. Again, not surprising. The commander has been using psionics. Now, he could easily be holed up in that building, though. That is actually what makes me nervous. Um, there is a real possibility the commander is just sitting inside there. He isn't even in the spaceship. Like, it happens a lot. Um, I mean, I could just see clearing out this huge spaceship only to find out the commander is sitting in that farmhouse over there. Whoops, that'd be awkward. Okay, this is going to be an issue now. Big issue. That hurt. Um, that hurt a lot. You have everything, don't you? Yeah, you do. Uh, alright. Throw the probe to you. Can I? Alright, we're gonna go back. Too far. Crap. Okay, well, anyway. Yeah, yeah, you're the one that's panicking all over the place, dude. Take an embarrassment out of yourself. Come on, kill it. Nope. Just doesn't get the shot. See, that's what happens when you're holding the rifle and the, the two tools. Alright, let's back that up. Um. <laughs> Cyber desks are easy to save scum. That's the story there. Reload, put it away. All right, you. This is Mr. Panics a lot. Gun down. Gun down. You are okay. So we're gonna try and keep you in the main squad. But yeah, Mr. Panics lock, you are out, sir. Main squad there. I would have liked to be able to verify I would have liked to be able to verify the alien commander is in the farmhouse. Again, my goal here is not to win this battle. Um, my goal is to capture that commander. I will, I will go straight to the commander, capture him, drag his butt into the spaceship, and leave if I can without casualties. Like, but no hesitation. Like, I'm, yeah, no, it's totally worth it. I'll do it even if I have tons of casualties. Um, it is worth it. Everything I've gathered up till this point isn't as nearly as valuable as him. He is the only real value target on this mission. Yeah. Okay. You're out, soldier. Ah. <sighs> So get onto the ship. Now there is a mod that turns off alien psionics. And I know many people would say, oh, that makes the game easier because it makes the ethereals honestly kind of comical. The ethereals are going to be pushovers without psionics. But... It's not just the ethereals you're fighting, it's also the mutton heads. Well, with explosives, they're fine. I'll, I'll, I'll admit it. They are not hard with explosives. If you can blow them up, mutton heads are pretty easy. The real issue is, is are you playing the way I'm playing or not? So I guess it would make it easy. 
the way I play it, it'll make it harder. Because honestly, without explosives, and mutton heads are pretty tough. And Psionix is technically a cheat. Um, that's all right. I like Psionix. It makes the game easy. Um, whoa. I just had a moth fly past me. How did that get in here? <laughs> like an actual moth. We're not talking about like in-game. Like a major... Oh! Good lord. How did that get in here? And why is he ramming into me? Dude, I'm being attacked by an alien moth. Send help immediately. Oh, time's almost up. Mind control. Oh no. Which one is that? Okay. Oh no, you've been mind controlled. Whatever will we do? Okay, no, I didn't do that. Seriously. All right. Ah, man. You guys see that, right? The little jerky thing? Yeah. Okay, that's not cool. I need that one out. I really should have a, plaz a laser pistol for them. Ah, sigh. No penalty would be nice, but oh well. Okay. Vilmos Kiss. Okay. Seriously? No! Uh, why did he stop? I don't know why he stopped. Can I right-click to stop? I maybe can. Okay, I can right-click to stop. Okay, that is useful. Hello, I can actually keep these idiots from running off wherever they're running to. Okay, let's get rid of that. One, two, three. One, two, three, okay. And I have my designated squad arrangement that I like for these parts. So I'm reasonably happy. I'm reasonably happy that that is still an engineer. Where did that thing come from? Where did it go? The moth isn't watching me. Dude, the aliens are after me, guys. Help. <laughs> Send help immediately. Oh, crap. Yeah, whatever. That should be fun. I love you. Seriously, some of my good soldiers are so refreshing to have. It's like, hey, screw, I don't care if I have an auto shot accuracy of 35%. I'm going to hit him three times anyway. Yeah, you rock, buddy. I know who you are. Love. Yo. See? <laughs> yeah. See? That is what you want. Yes? Um, and plus a high psionic score, which obviously is unknown. But anyway, we'll make do without knowing that yet. Not for much longer. This is going to be next time. I am not ending this mission without psionics, guys. Okay? Like, I'm making that 100% clear. Alright, let's go pop the door. Hit Gadzooks. Oh. <gasps> Hello. I maybe found him. I'm a, I'm a soldier. Mm. Just reverse angle. The other one looks like a small launcher. But we'll go ahead and scan him just real fast. Huh? What do you mean not enough time units? Ah. Come on. Okay, um, do we care? That, that really looks like a small launcher. 
uh, who has a small launcher so I can compare. Yeah, it is worth it. Yeah, that's a small launcher. Okay. Uh, let's see, auto shop. Not enough time units. Huh? Okay, never mind. You're, you're exiting. Okay. <laughs> like I said, it is worth it to capture the commander. I really don't care how many aliens I go through in order to get them. I will get the commander. Um, like, it's not a question of when. I will do it. Um, or it's not a question of if. All right, let's see. I double check. That still looks like the launcher guy. There is that mock. That thing is big. For our part of the world, that thing is big. Medic. Hmm. Yeah, well, that, I wish I cared. Yeah, I can't get him. Okay. Alright, the good news is I appear to only have two people who are vulnerable to psionic attacks. I say appear because, you know, until we actually know the stats... Mm, We'll not actually know. Um, but the stats I have seen so far make me believe we only have two people vulnerable. No, not the stats. The attacks we have seen so far lead me to believe that only two are vulnerable. Blah, I can say that straight. I can do it. Words coming out of my mouth work good. Risky, but worth it. Um, okay, see that right there? I don't know what that is. For all I know, that is a mind uh, is the mind probe. I can't tell what it is. He's got something in his hands. I know he does. The question is, is it's a pistol? Pistol. It's just a pistol. All right, that's two down. And I am focusing on the ship. Yes, I am. Dude. <laughs> yeah, it is. Okay. Wait. They don't pick up their gun, do they? So that's a third one? Dang, that spot's popular. I am more... Andrew is under control. Eklund is under control. So no one in my ship now. Got it. And see how it flicks to that upper floor area? Yeah, you know what I think that means. Um, all right, looks like we cleared out that area. Um, now, it's important to understand that the enemy commander is still suffering morale penalties, just like my people would be in this same situation. Um, yes, as long as I am slaughtering his people, his morale is going down. Boom. Oh, don't kill the commander. Oh, don't kill the commander. Oh, anyway. There went something. That was a grenade, so I don't want that going off near my people. And that was in the upper area, which I really don't want going off near my people. Yes. Um, all right, that looks clear. Uh, we really want to avoid casualties, even if I have to cheat a lot. Uh... Hmm. We've got something. All right, mind probe that part of the. Of the do, 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 do. Soldier. Kill him. See, now I feel like an insect crawling on my arm. This really does kind of feel like what an alien psionic attack would look like. Yes. Ah, it's a moth! I hate moths! <laughs> Or giant spiders or whatever. I don't know what they'd make you see because, you know. Yeah. I ain't you. I hear lots of door movement. All I know is that this area is relatively clear. Which is great. 
Okay. Um, and let's see. Do I have my people in the plane restored? I do. So let's keep you parked back over here. Facing the wall. Because if you get mind controlled, I want you to be in the least convenient spot for the aliens. The aliens are like, aha, I mind controlled some of your people. And I'm like, eh, whatever. Forget about it. They're like, you're supposed to care. And I'll be like, eh, whatever. All right, we need to clear the outside. Unfortunately, it's true. Um, see, this is where we can find out. If I reload, I'm going to remember to save. Oh, crap, time's up. All right, looks like we're just going to be stopping here in the middle of this mission. Um, this one does have an alien commander. We are definitely getting mind probed. We are definitely getting attacked. Um, we've lost a bunch of the low-level stuff, but most of my valuable units are still intact. So it's going reasonably well. Honestly, my main squad is intact. That is the key point here. We're going to call this Battle 3, and we will be picking that back up. Lit 32? Eh, whatever. We'll be picking that back up later. You guys have a good one.